Good morning children. Today we shall learn about the area of a triangle. Now we know that the area of a right angle triangle is half base multiplied by height. Now the height of a right triangle is the length of the perpendicular. So we can write it as the area of a right angle triangle is half base multiplied by the perpendicular square units. What about the area of other triangles? Here we see there is an acute angle triangle which means all the angles are less than 90 degrees. We can show triangle ABC as the part of this rectangle ABEF. The width of this rectangle is same as the height of this triangle. Correct children? Now we draw a perpendicular on AB which is the base of the triangle from C and CD is actually the height of the triangle ABC. If we observe carefully the rectangle ABEF is divided into two rectangles. Rectangle ADCF and rectangle DBEC. Here the area of triangle ADC is half the area of this rectangle that is rectangle ADCF. Same way area of the triangle DBC is half of the area of this rectangle which is rectangle DBEC. So we can say area of triangle ABC is equal to half the area of the whole rectangle ABEF. Correct? Now we know the area of rectangle is length multiplied by its width. So we can say the area of this triangle ABC is equal to half multiplied by length multiplied by width of the rectangle. Or we can say it is equal to half the base multiplied by height of the triangle. Why? Because see here the length of the rectangle is actually the base of this triangle and the width of the rectangle is also the height of this triangle ABC. Now let's take an obtuse angle triangle. Look, triangle ABC is half of this parallelogram ABCD. Now we know the area of the parallelogram is base multiplied by height. So the area of triangle ABC is half the area of the parallelogram that is half multiplied by base multiplied by height. The height of parallelogram is also the height of triangle ABC. This way we can prove the area of obtuse triangle is also half multiplied by base multiplied by height of the triangle. So remember children, what is the area of any triangle? Area of any triangle is equal to half multiplied by base multiplied by height and the unit would be square units where unit could be anything such as meter, centimeter, kilometer etc. The distance between the base and the opposite vertex is called the height of the triangle. That's all for now. Bye-bye children.